What's up guys? I got that shifter lever in, the new one. So we're going to do a little bit of work on the DRZ today. Get that all fixed up, ready to go back out on the trails. Shift lever from Zeta. So it's supposed to be tougher. It feels pretty light, honestly, compared to the other one. So I don't know how well it's going to do. It's supposed to have some adjustability to it too. You see this? This here, I'm not really sure how the adjustability works. I'm using it for boots and stuff like that because I know that the old shifter that I had, I kind of had to finagle my boot underneath it a little bit. So hopefully this one will be a little bit better. Right there is where it broke off at and where I need to get to that nut there. So I have to take this skid plate off to be able to get through here. See this bolt right here? So I've taken out the other two, but I have slowly over time stripped this, stripped this bolt away to the point where when I'm trying to get it off, it just spins. Okay, so I was, I was able to get that out by uh, taking the star pattern bit and just hammering it into this a little bit and then I was able to get it out, so we're all free now. Okay, so now all we need is an eight millimeter socket. You just stick it up through here and loosen that nut right there. Okay, so now the difficult part is gonna be wiggling, it's gonna be wiggling the end free. You see like this part here, I'm gonna have to wiggle that free from being stuck on the shaft there. Okay, so I was able to get that free. Honestly, if you have like a kind of grody bike like I do where you take it through the mud and stuff, you just have to pry everything off. You know that. Um, so here is the old one. There's the, the broken piece right there. So we can compare it to the new one. Honestly, they feel very similar. This one feels like it's made out of more of a kind of cruddy metal. And I'm hoping that's what's true. I, I hope that this is more beefy. Also, the end of it, this seems a bit nicer with all of the adjustability and stuff. It still does the same thing that the old one did, where it's got that spring in it, so the end won't break off. But having the adjustability on the end, I think is gonna be really nice. So let's go put this on. Okay, we got it on there. So check that out. It looks really nice. Okay, so let's mess with this a little bit. I honestly don't know what this does because I didn't buy this for that at all. Um, so I'm just going to mess with it and see what the adjustability is on it real quick. So let's loosen this a bit. <laughs> see what the, the, what the point of it actually is. Maybe I should read the instructions. May oh, so it turns around like this. So you can adjust the position of it if you want it up a little bit like that if you want it forward if you want it down that that's a neat act that's actually a really neat way to do it I, i'm just going to do out as far as possible so it seems to have notches in it where it kind of locks in that's really neat i like that a lot i didn't even uh care to have that feature i just care to have something that actually works um feels like it'll do the job yeah there's honestly so much more space now. Oh wow, I can put it in neutral. <laughs> There's so much more space now between these two, which is actually really beautiful. So one thing I wanted to point out real quick, whenever you are tightening a bolt that goes into something that is open like this, be really careful whenever you put that bolt in there because you can easily have that bolt going in some direction that is off and strip that bolt. I've done that many times and I almost did it on this. Um, you kind of have to push the bolt in funny ways and see where it grabs right. Because if it's grabbing wrong, you're just gonna strip that bolt that goes in there completely. So we'll see how this uh, goes. I'm gonna try this out. The next time that I go riding, I'm gonna try this out and we'll see how it holds up, but it seems to be perfect so far. I'm just glad that it's fixed. All right, we'll see y'all later, bye.